The Nazca lines are thought to be ancient paths etched by a long-forgotten people. But I no longer believe this popular theory. Not since I unearthed new stones on a Nazca line concealing an altar. moving. <laughs> what are you doing, Jav? I thought they gave you a new mower. Java no like mower. Don't tell me you're still afraid of technology. Ah, uh, well, not to worry. Your good buddy Martin is gonna bring you into the 21st century. I think Java's afraid of it. Hang on, big fella. You've got to embrace technology. Get on. Nothing can go wrong. <laughs> Yeah, we've all heard that before. Usually before something tragic happens. Uh, maybe that's not such a good idea. <laughs> okay, maybe we need to start with something simple. Like a pager. Pager? What a pager. Now I can contact you anywhere, anytime. Go ahead, Di. Try giving Java a call on yourself. I should call the Bad Idea Hotline instead, because you have a lot of them today. Ah, oh, Java no like pager. Java may go away. <laughs> this is going to be harder than I thought. Look, it still works. Earth to technology, wizard. That's not the pager, that's the center. It's coming from that door over there. After you. Savvy cyber job. Wow, cool. Uh, maybe you can help me open this experimental single charge laser beam container. I don't think that's such a good idea. <laughs> wow. some seriously cool technology. Uh, easy does it, Martin. Listen up, gang. An archaeologist disappeared while doing research on the Nazca lines. Aren't they those mysterious earth etchings in South America? Mm-hmm. Peru, to be precise. And since Professor Sampson's disappearance, very strange things have been happening there. I bet you was engulfed by a dust devil. They're fairly common in that region. <gasps> Billy, would you mind recalibrating? Hmm. Huh? I've got to cover, Billy. <laughs> oh. 
Well, I, for one, think it suits you. I think it's time for you to go. <sighs> go! seen a single person since we got here. It's like everyone just got up and left. Yeah! Take that, zombie demon! Hello! <laughs> we came here to find an archaeologist, not zombies! Good point. Take it from here, John. <laughs> okay, so there's approximately 300 figures etched in the surface of the desert. Huh. I see someone's been reading more than the back of a cereal box. Actually, I've been reading Supernatural Digest. The Nazca lines are a hotbed of supernatural theories. I'm afraid to even ask. My theory is they were made to summon spirits that will protect the Nazca people. Well, the spirit didn't do its job very well because the Nazca people obviously bailed on this place. <laughs> Anything in there? She was researching some obscure legend about the lines and, and an altar of some kind. Diana, you gotta see this! What'd you find? An old friend of ours. Ugh, a friend I'd like to forget. Hearing activated. Slime scan selected. Yes. Analyzing data. Ectoplasmic residue composition unknown. Conclusion, does not exist or is not of this Earth. That's strange. It's not in the data banks. Let's send a sample to the center. Huh. What's this? Huh? Job a win! Now this is what I call a quality clue. This writing is like nothing I've ever seen. I bet this was left by some mutant group of early humanoids. Then you should be able to understand it perfectly. We have to figure out what these hieroglyphics mean. Maybe it can tell us where the professor disappeared to. Ah! Ah! Look at this! Ah! Java! If you're down here, give me a sign! Is that enough of a sign? Are you guys okay? Don't know yet. Well, we're here. We might as well check it out. Are you kidding? We have no idea where we are or what this place is! And I'm still freaked out by that weird sound up there. I know. Isn't it great? Ah, this is some kind of lightweight alloy. But how did it get beneath the Nazca line? I hope you're not implying that something made out of an alloy was buried here before the line was made. You watch activated. Bioscan selected. Not buried. Crashed. Subject consists of hybrid alloy. Estimated date of construction. 200 BC. That makes it official. We're in an alien spacecraft. Something here. Java! No! Just when I thought it couldn't get any creepier. 
Okay. Correction. We're in an inhabited alien spacecraft. Huh? This must be the Professor's scarf. Scarf minus owner plus creepy alien craft equals bad feeling. What was that? Quick, under here! I think it's gone. Ugh. I'd rather wait under here for a few days just to make sure. Huh, so now we know where the slime is coming from. Come on, we're safe now. Kinesis! Spread out so it can't focus on all of us! Suspended animation? So that's how they survived down here for so long. has to be a slimy pool of trash. Uh-oh, an intergalactic trash creature. All right, bring it on, creep. Creep? You're one to talk. Thanks for leaving us behind back there. Hey. Wow. Well, hello. I'm Martin Mystery. Hello. I'm not interested. 
Apparently, this is where the aliens dump all their prisoners. Is that what I think it is? Ah. Uh. Unique script. Crystal embedded in the cover. I don't believe it. It's the Nazca Book of the Dead. Huh. So you know what this book is? We were hoping you could fill us in on what's going on here. I found evidence that the ancient Peruvians confiscated a tome from hostile aliens and were able to trap the aliens underground with the use of these mystical Nazca lines. <sighs> if only I could translate the language. Maybe we can use the U-Watch. Huh. Ah! The U-Watch, Martin? Huh? All right, the U-Watch. Hmm. U-Watch activated. It's translating. It says the aliens were planning to take over the world when the ancient Peruvian shaman trapped the aliens in their ships by hiding the Book of the Dead. It also says here that there's a ship under every line. Whoa, that's some translator. Considering we all entered the Nazca line the same way, the altar must be some sort of portal. And whatever opens must close. We just need to get back up there and seal it up for good. <laughs> oh. Sorry. be suppressed underground. Your planet will be ours. No, wait! We've got to get out of here and seal up the portal! Take care of some unfinished business. <clears throat> Yeah. Yeah. Done. Yeah. Uh, uh, 
Everybody. The world appears to be safe for yet another day. Ah, uh, here. You might want this. Buddy, this is the best sci-fi book I've ever read. I hope we never have to open it again. Whoa, Java. Check that bit of techno gadgetry out. Java? Huh? Dragon? Dragon? I can't believe he's still playing that ridiculous <laughs> game. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 Java no like technology. Looks like the old Java's back. I guess you can't teach an old caveman new tricks. <laughs> <laughs>